showing off their science and engineering skills, some Beaufort County middle schoolers recently won a web-based STEM competition sponsored by the U.S. Army. E-Cyber is a nationwide competition for engineering and so kids compete against each other um, through the nation and um, and what they're trying to figure out is something that will help society. It's collaborative. You can be a group of three or four and you work together for months at a time. There is a rubric, there is a mission folder. They identify, the students identify a community problem and then they work towards designing a solution to the problem. This solar power boat was built by a team of sixth graders at Buford Middle School. They play second in the state for their eco-friendly motor. We use solar powered energy to drive the motors instead of using gasoline and fossil fuels. We had a solar power, a solar panel on top that connected to the um, drive shafts and spun the propellers. The winning sixth grade team is from River Ridge Academy. Their experiment looked at the effectiveness of thermal cups. We took two different brands of cups and we tested them to see what, how much ice would melt to see which one melted the most ice. Two other high scoring teams also came from Buford Middle. One group of 7th graders placed second in the state for creating this cost effective solar power water heater that can be used in homes. We did the idea to like warm and cool some waters in the Buford homes for like some which cannot provide heating and for their water. Buford Middle State Champion 7th grade team measured the energy in salt water from different bodies of water around Buford County. They hope to expand on their findings for next year's competition. That we can try to figure out how we can use it to power larger powerhouses like factories along the Savannah River to reduce the pollution and that will help our marine ecosystems and it will make our coastal community of Savannah, Beaufort, Charleston a better place for tourists and animals. One teacher says she's amazed by the students work. It's very proud, <laughs> very proud. They did, they did a, a lot of good work and a lot of um, a lot of stick to itiveness and a lot of science went behind it. Each member of the two first place teams won a thousand dollar savings bond. Second place students won five hundred dollar savings bonds. At Buford Middle School, Ron Lopes, Buford County School District.